Hey hello friends welcome to my channel in this python beginner tutorial series today let's discuss about python dictionary okay this is part 2 of our python dictionary video in part 1 we discussed about what is dictionary and how to create a dictionary and how to access dictionary items so continuing with that video series today let's discuss about how to change dictionary items and how to add dictionary items and how to remove dictionary items right so first we will look about how to change dictionary items there are two ways in which you can change the dictionary items one is one by changing the values and another one using the update method let's look at an example here so we i already have a dictionary called dictionary one um, and it has values as name as such in age as 49 and date of birth as 24 4 1973 okay so this is the key and value of my dictionary so say if i want to update a value say if, say i want to update the age okay so what i can do is i can simply use the dictionary of the the key what is the key age right so age equal to 50 so this way you can actually easily update the value of a key in dictionary okay now see the age has now become 50 okay this is a very simplest way of updating the value in a dictionary and another alternate simple way is to use an update method okay so there is something called update method in update method dictionary one dot update here what you can do is you can provide the new attribute value so i want to update the age right so age is 50 so this way also i can update the value in a dictionary okay so we saw about two ways one is by just providing the attribute uh, key with the dictionary and providing its value another one is using update method okay so these are this is the, these are the ways in which how you can update dictionary items and the next let's see how to add the dictionary items say you have many values in it what if i want to add a new column to it say i have name age and date of birth i want to add something called sports so what kind of sports is such an illinois brain so say dictionary one of <clears throat> sports equal to say cricket okay now i'm just printing dictionary one let's see right now we can see a new value called sports cricket is now added to my existing dictionary okay this way you can add whatever columns you want to the existing dictionary okay so this is how you can add the values to the dictionary and finally we'll see how to remove dictionary items okay so there are many ways in you in which you can remove dictionary items first we will discuss about pop okay so dictionary one dot pop of the value so, so <clears throat> what pop does is pop generally removes the item with a specified key name okay so here i have provided the key as age so it will remove the key name All right let me run this so now it, it removed age completely okay so this is how you can use pop method so in case if you want to remove date of birth also you can use date of birth All right this is how you can use the pop method to remove any item from the dictionary using a specified key name okay this is one way another one is there is something called pop item okay in this pop item you don't want to provide any key value 
it's just a simple method so what pop item does is pop item generally removes the last added item so here in uh, last added item is data bar so in case if i add um, say sports as cricket now if i run this pop item what will happen is it will remove the sports because that's the last added item right so what pop item does is it will remove the last added item okay but one key thing to note here is again um, a disclaimer is if you are using versions before python 3.7 it will not remove the last item it will gen it will generally remove a random a random item from the dictionary so if you are using i am using python 3.7 and above so it is removing me the last inserted value whereas else if you are using earlier versions of python it will not remove earlier it will not remove the final one it will randomly remove any value it can either remove name or age date of birth sports anything it can remove okay so that's the catch with pop item <clears throat> all right now ne jumping to next to part yeah we'll we'll see how delete and clear work okay so delete as usual i can use del del keyword and your dictionary name and within square brackets you can pass the attribute say date of birth okay now what it will do is it will delete that particular value okay you can use pop also but again this is an alternate way of removing a value by providing the key okay so this is one way and if without even providing the um, attribute you can provide the simple dictionary like it will delete this entire dictionary if you use delete with the dictionary name it will remove the entire dictionary now it will throw an error because i'm printing after deleting right so it says name dict1 is not defined because i have deleted my dictionary here okay so these are two ways in which you can use del keyword and finally we you have something called clear okay clear method is as we seen in our previous examples with tuples and all what clear does is it just clears the value in the dictionary but the actual dictionary exist right now if i use a clear method uh, it what it did is it deleted entire values in the clear uh, in the dictionary but it it has an empty dictionary okay so okay so this is how you can use clear method with dictionary right i hope now you understood how to update dictionary items and how to add dictionary items and how to remove dictionary items all right so yes that's all what i want to cover as part of this video guys i will come up with another interesting video regards to python if you like my video please subscribe to my channel thank you